Milan. They're off in the San Luis Rey. It's a quick beginning for Havana Bell, who goes straight to the front, joined by Southern Freedom at the rail, and in between them, going somewhere as prominent as well. High ball in the pink colors on the extreme outside is in fourth. Then it's Gaga A uh, racing on the outside of Powerfoot, who's six lengths off the lead. Energia Fribi is next, followed by Generosidad. It's then a gap of five to the two trailers, and they are quick Casablanca and big John B, as usual, with no early speed as they get ready to cross the dirt for the first time. On the outside, it is Havana Bell and Southern Freedom in the white blinkers at the rail. Just in behind them comes Highball in third, two lengths off this moderate tempo. Then comes Going Somewhere, settled in the fourth spot, eager to get going and guided a little bit off the rail. Gaga A is the gray in mid-pack, racing on the outside of Power Foot. Then Energia Fribi, who's about a dozen lengths off the lead. Generosidad is three quarters behind her at the rail, Quis. Casablanca and Big John B is outside of that rival. Into the turn they go for the first time, and the leader at the rail is Southern Freedom. Up alongside is Havana Bell. Havana Bell goes on to lead by a length. In third comes High Ball, just tracking them, and a gap of about five to going somewhere in fourth. Gaga Eyes making progress. Powerfoot is asked to get going down at the rail. Then comes Energia Fribi on the outside of Generosidad. Big John B and Quick Casablanca at the back. Nine lengths covers the field as they head to the half-mile pole. It's still Havana Bell carving out the fractions pursued by Southern Freedom and High Ball three wide in third. Gaga Eyes in fourth. Power foot at the rail in fifth, about five lengths off the lead. Inside of that one comes Generosidad, who's actually in between horses, five lengths off them. Then Energia Fribi, who has eight to make up. Quick Casablanca is looking for some racing room while commencing a bid. Big John B yet to do his best work and going somewhere. In the meantime, Havana Bell is trying to close the deal. She's in front three quarters of a length. Now Generosidad is making a bold bid and has room if good enough. And Generosidad is up to take the lead. Outside of her comes Highball, who's running a big one. Gaga A is next. And then Energia Fribi. Final furlong. Generosidad in front. Three quarters of a length to Highball. And it will be the distaffer, Generosidad and Tiago Pereira to win the San Luis Rey. Quick Casablanca came flying for second. Energia Fribi was third. Highball fourth. Entering the winner's circle, number nine, Generosidad. A seven-year-old, Bay Mare, by Nadawi, out of Zhang V. Owned by Aras Philipson, Incorporated. The winning trainer is Paulo Lobo, and the jockey, Tiago Pereira. Generosidad was bred in Uruguay by her owner, Aras Philipson. Ladies and gentlemen, in the winner's circle, to make the presentation for the San Luis Rey Stakes, we are honored to have with us one of the greatest jockeys of all time, the one and only Lafitte Pink Eye Jr., who retired the world's winningest jockey with 9,530 victories. He had five wins in the San Luis Rey, five wins in the Santa Anita Handicap, was the 14-time leading rider of the Santa Anita Winter Spring Meet, and is the all-time Santa Anita leader with 2,860 victories. He also, of course, is a winner of the George Wolf Memorial Jockey Award. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the one and only Lafitte Pink Eye Jr. Generosa Don takes the San Luis Ray here. I'm joined by Paula Lobo and via FaceTime, the owner. First of all, does, is the owner excited? Yeah, they are. They are huge, huge owner and huge breeder in Brazil, mm -hmm. and he likes to follow his horses. Well, I'm glad that he's awake right now. I'm not sure what time it is, but congratulations down there on the cell phone. Everyone here at Santa Anita has been cheering you on. Paula, what made the difference for this filly here today? She's a grade one winner in Brazil, but she breaks through for the first time stakeside. Uh, for a long time, we were looking for a long distance, and she had her race on January, and we pointed for today. 
And she is, like you said, a marathoner, although you have run her shorter. Looking forward, are you going to keep trying to find these longer distance races, even if it means fighting against the boys? Or are you just going to take it one step at a time? No, you know, we are going to decide because she's a seven years old mare and they are thinking to breed her this year. And then we are going to decide this week. Well, congratulations here. Thank you so much. Congratulations. And congratulations down there. We have to give another uh, big congratulations. Jetta Rose side takes the San Luis Ray.